best thing working for Hakim Optica, it's um, my co-workers. So it's a friendly environment. So we're here to look for new uh, glasses for you today. I like the, the energy. So right now I wear a square shape, mm -hmm. but I want something slightly more, more edgy. Fantastic. Different. We're all there to help each other. It's team. This is a tortoiseshell color, square okay. shape, just to see if you've worn the style before. I like people who work with me. Everybody become a family. Feels like a second home. Buru Kavisho. When I was a child, I could see the worried face of my mother, and I could see that she really struggles how to survive. So at the age of 10, I start looking for a job. I started first with a blacksmith, and eventually I fainted. And my mother took me to a doctor, and they told me, this boy is too light. It's not good for that job. So the next job was um, a guy used to make magnifying glasses from window panels. And I find out there is a lot into the science of optics, how people can use that to correct the vision. And so I took some magnifiers, some minifiers, and so on. And I went near some busy mosque. Here you can have your vision, here you can have your eyes, you can have your correction for 25 cents. I made more money than an entire week. 19, I moved to the south, the Persia Gulf. I um, joined the Navy. At that time, they needed uh, divers. They gave me a crash course, and the next thing, I became a diver. And from then on, I uh, pick up the affinity for diving. When I finished my Navy, I came to Germany, and from Germany I work uh, in a company that make uh, camera lenses. Uh, then uh, one of the colleagues uh, moved to Switzerland. They arranged my papers and my permit to go to Switzerland. There I made these uh, telescope lenses, the large lenses. Those days, probably I get uh, $100 uh, a week which was a big money. I had an apartment, I had a car, I learned to dance and I become a dancer. I impressed all the girls. <laughs> in Switzerland or in Germany, I cannot own my own factory. So I have to go somewhere that I can have my own factory. I wrote a letter that I like to emigrant. The first answer I got was from Canada. They give me a ticket, they paid a pocket money, and then I put me in a hotel. Bashalom gave me a job. I made lenses all day long, and I repaired the machinery every night. And then one day I passed by Elm Street in downtown Toronto, and I saw a sign in the Elmwood Hotel, a space for rent. And I went to look at the space. It was a big uh, dancing hall. It was a dining hall. So I took both of them for $200 a month. I started to compete with those sophisticated companies that make lenses with the modern machinery. I did that for a while with the Emory. That's why this hand, and this hand is somewhat different, is because of grinding. Little by little did half wholesale, half retail, and I made probably a few millions of pair of glasses. And Hakim expanded just uh, from Toronto further and further. And in every city, I somehow I captured the market share. Hakim Optical has over 160 stores all across Canada. You can just look at the lens just by the look of it. You could say the prescription. The difference between me and the other optical store is that most of the other optical store are not lens makers. All my life was in lens making production. And now if you're looking for something a lot more bold, I have the philosophy to all my uh, opticians, to all my servers. I think they look very nice on you. 
Never argue with the customer. Lose an argument. You gain the customer. Oh, I like these ones the best. I think they're really nice. With this philosophy, people come to me for 30 years, 40 years. That is for me is pride and joy. I like to take care of the customer to make Mr. Hakim look good. I had no intention to go into hotel business. It was only 10 years ago that my ex-girlfriend and I, we go everywhere. We were passing the lease. Under the sonar of my yacht, I find out that the reef continues from almost miles. There's a natural cut in front of this uh, island, and I park my boat inside the cut. And I find out, my God, it's a live reef, lot of shark, lot of fish, lobster, caves. This is a gold mine. I find the owner, I bought, no question asked. I designed some building and I start that building. And finally, we end up with a 100 room and a lot of penthouses. And I put an airstrip and we have a rooftop disco. We could basically entertain 200 people a day. You see that this lady that I put on the bottom of that swimming pool, I call it the Lady Hakim. One of the swimming pool is 200 foot, the other one is 260 foot. It's a bigger than Olympic swimming pool. We put like 10,000 fruit trees. It grows to six or eight foot tall and then gives 20, 30 papayas every year. We have at least 20,000 bushes of the flowers and plants. Look at this, so beautiful. We cut hundreds of shoots out of this and replant them. My passion is garden. I look like a farmer, I act like a farmer. Why I'm not a farmer, I don't know. The government made entire area into a sanctuary. That means we are the only one is allowed to build in this island. And in the future, we are planning to put solar panels and wind turbine in the water that we can generate energy for free. We'll have enough uh, power here that we can run the whole place. Do it large or don't do it at all. That's why most of my women, they were taller than me because I like <laughs> bigger and taller. I'm still working 12 hours a day, non-stop, and I love it. Most of the employees for Hakim Optical, they work for so many years. I've been working for Hakim Optical for the last 20 years. 27 years. Since 1981. More than 20 years. 27 years. The best thing about Mr. Hakim is his sense of humor and his big passion about life. He never gives up. A lot of people don't know that I don't have a formal education, you know? I just learned through the life. One of my pride and joy in Canada is the Canadian recognition by the Governor General giving me the knighthood. It fueled my energy and I end up to do double for this country. He's always like tried to make us uh, be better, do better. He is so friendly. Whenever he visits the lab, he shakes hands with each and every person. He's amazing to work with. I'm originally very family oriented and uh, I'm a very passionate family person. My biggest motivation in my life, I should say, it was a woman. And the first woman that uh, I wanted to impress was my mother. My mother never said I love you. She showed that she loved me, she did everything for me, but it was not the common one says to the other, I love you. For the rest of my life, I think that the woman was the key to my motivation. I always wanted to be bigger and better in order to impress a woman. Thank you very much, Mr. Hakim, for giving us a job. Pues estoy muy agradecida con la compañía, con Hakim Optica, por la oportunidad que he tenido. Thank you. It's a pleasure working for you.
I'm building a lot of intelligent people to uh, follow my footsteps. They can take it what it is and make it bigger. That is my expectation. I want to thank you people who stood by me for the past 50 years and to help me to build this company to what it is today. Without your help, I could never be here. And I want to take the same opportunity to thank all the customers that for a number of years, they become a repeat customers. That makes me to be proud of my profession. Thank you, all of you. برو قوی شو اگر راحت جهان طلبی که در نظام طبیعت ضعیف پامال است which means if you want to be a winner get yourself strength become strong so that you are visible because the weaker you are the smaller you are you could be under the foot smashed without being noticed I am Sir Karim Hakimi, and this is the life through my eyes. In the beginning, when I was hired, uh, they told me, that, don't forget to say something in Spanish to him. He jokes around. He's a really nice person. He's a funny guy. <laughs> 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 He's a funny guy. He is. And don't put that funny guy. Come on. Finally, the day I met him, he came to me. When he left, I forgot totally about, like, say something in Spanish to him. It's nice to work with somebody. Work like a team. Happy 50th! Okay, no. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> Just <laughs> happy anniversary. Happy 50th to Hakim Optical. It's a pleasure working for you. Feliz aniversario, Mr. Hakim. <laughs> happy 50th anniversary. Happy 50th anniversary. anniversary. That's it. Okay. That's it. Okay. You said that. You said that. You said that. You said that.